Hello everybody, I'm Dave, you may call me Mo Down Joe, welcome back to Let's Play 13. So, we made our way to that ski chalet just fine. Get Kim out through the back of the cabin, we'll land the chopper nearby. Kim? Another woman? How many women are we going to have to deal with here? Eh, yeah, well, whatever. Oh, well, we found that nice little ski chalet, so I wonder if we're going to meet this woman, Kim, see what's up with her. She seems nice, I'm guessing. Don't move! What? Who? Whoa! What's with the gun, lady? My God, you're alive. You know me? Kim, the girl in the photo. Is that a photo? I don't remember the photo. The surgeon did an outstanding job. Surgeon? Tell me to increase the dose of the fentanyl. Well, obviously, I had surgery. Start the tattoo. Tattoo. Go ahead. Oh, that tattoo, right, the 13th tattoo, right, right, right. How do you feel, son? This is the widow of Steve Rowland, the man whose identity you've taken. I'm... Steve was number 13, I was 17. The leaders of the conspiracy had my husband killed by the mongoose. But Steve managed to drag himself back here before dying. Ah, so, wait. There's a married couple within the One day, 20. I'll know the faces of those who betrayed him. I want them all to burn. You hear me? Even number one. And I want to find the bastard to put the hit on my friend Sheridan. And why? Wait, wait, what? Okay, he knew 13 before all this. 13's married to 17. When they see Steve's ghost, they'll slip up. Also figure out you betrayed them, Kim. I'm gonna have to. I'll think about this and hopefully during the firefight later on. Yes, there'll be a firefight. That um, what the, this all means. But hmm. so uh, all right. So I guess that's the wife of the guy whose role I've taken. And anything interesting, boss? I keep a weapon hidden in here. Just in case. Oh. No, that'll be handy for later. Just remember that bench. Hey, can you hear me? Uh, well, what is it, Mom? What is it, wife? Honey? Listen, I've identified three members of the conspiracy. They're headed for the Spads camp to attend a secret meeting. You have to be there, too. My part of the mission is finished. Now it's your turn. <laughs> Cover me! Um, okay, sure. I found it! Over here! Oh, shit! Well, let's go ahead and take all of this! Oh, can't hold more ammo. Ain't that just grand? Oh, well, folks, let's, we have to take all the... Well, every possible piece of weaponry we can, because this is going to be a huge firefight. So, uh, let me see. I guess mostly I'm going to be sticking with the, with the old Magnum, because there's not much else to do. Oh, oh hi! Whoa! Um... Yeah, I think... Sorry, folks, I'm just gonna have to reload this, cuz... I know, I just got hit with the rocket launcher. Like an idiot. Be right back. Yeah, yes. Alright. Well, normally we would save this for when I'm dead, but, um, you know, rocket launcher, pretty much sure sign that I'm gonna die, so. Whoa! Yeah, where's that guy with the rocket launcher? Oh, up there! Alright, sure. Yeah, obviously you don't want to leave the damn chalet until you got rid of the guy with the rocket launcher. Which I think there are many of. Or at least there will be multiple of during this whole escapade, so yeah. Uh, obviously you don't want to do what I did the first time around. That is just pure stupidity. And, hold on, I think... Oh, hi! <laughs> Bye! Yeah, we're staying as close to the inside of this chalet just to be safe. Oh, you want to come inside? Do you want to come inside? Um, yeah, don't come inside. Go for it, guys! It's really silly. They think they can come inside. Oh, an AK-47, fully loaded, ladies and gentlemen. Well, the. All fire for this lets you switch between uh, between auto between fully automatic and burst fire, which is really nice. I like that. 
but, uh, you know, you take what you can get as far as... Oh, whoa! Here, sure, sure. Um, I have no qualms with that, but... Just try to be a little more careful. Oh, whoa! Oh, good Goodbye! And... Ouch! Like I said, folks, you want to stay inside, get most cover, and obviously they won't be able to hit you with their damn uh, rocket launchers. Um, where the hell did that explosion come from? It hit the right side, so you would think. Oh, right. I think that's pretty low. Normally I'm obsessed with compulsive about that kind of thing. We've got him! We gotta surround him! Yes, you think I can I can hear you, you know. And there's another rocket launcher I'm not here seeing. Well, at least the recoil is actually helping for this, but oh god almighty, this is gonna be this is a brutal shootout, ladies and gentlemen. I did not do too well my first time through, and I am running out of uh, magnum rounds. So come on. Oh yes! I guess we picked up another uh, another Uzi, so. We get to dual wield that these. Ah, uh, dual wielding. Folks, there is no better way, if you cannot, if you are not at all sure you can get a headshot, there is no quicker way to waste guys than dual wielding, dual wielding Uzi's. Dual wielding Uzi's. That. Although, the recoil on any of the auto gun, automatic rifles is just wild, so that's why I like, I like the AK-47 better. The Kalish, they call it. I'm guessing they don't want to give a free sponsorship to Kalishnikov Industries or whoever that makes the AK-40. Like I said, folks, not a gun. Mm. Alright, where's the rocket launcher? Where's the rocket launcher? Ouch. I do love that. Oh! Now there's guys coming in on helicopters. No, folks, we want to take out the guys sitting in those helicopters really quickly, because, well, they're sitting in helicopters, they have a height advantage over us, so, well, what else, the, what the hell else are we supposed to do? But, yeah, yeah, let's just reload those real quick, let's... whoa, yeah, I have no handle over any of the recoil on these weapons, so I just have to kind of take what I can get with the... Come on, let me get in a quick, quick, few quick bursts. Hey, actually, hey, I'm out of helmet. That still sounds awfully, awfully wrong. There, Kim. I'll get her out. Wait, what's she doing? Damn, she's taking off. Uh, well, uh, I guess that's our cue to move. We don't have to worry about. Come on, let's evac now. I right. knew we should have trusted her. Right, that's our cue. Break out the RPG. Oh, fuck! Right. Break out the cabin! Come on, just. Just blow the door open for me. Thank you. We knew that was gonna come. Ah. I'll take more collision and cough ammo. More, more collision ammo, and I still don't know what that those are for. But oh well. In the meantime, I'm gonna go ahead and take advantage of my little AK-47 as far as I can run. Brings me back to my days playing Golden Eye. Although I was probably not the best when it came to Golden Eye. Um, my weapon of choice was the Glob, aka the one gun that couldn't kill on a headshot. Yeah, yeah, I was not. It, but I was like, oh, it's an auto. It's du dual wieldable, dual wieldable, and it's automatic. What? Go wrong? Um, that sounds like something can go wrong. Yeah, this definitely set looks like. And we're dead. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the show. If you like what you saw, stay tuned. There'll be more to come. Until then, I'm Dave, and we are dead.